Okay, let's go and do a factory reset on this Samsung Galaxy A42 5G. I'm going to show you two different types of uh, factory reset. The first one is by going to settings and in case that the phone gets stuck on the Samsung logo, get freezed and won't take you to the initial setup screen, then you won't be able to go back to settings and do the factory reset again. So uh, we're going to have to use the um, uh, phone buttons in order to do that, uh, do the factory reset one more time to uh, calibrate the motherboard and make it the phone work properly. Okay, so let's go really quick and open uh, settings of the phone. And uh, now let's go really quick and uh, okay, open general management. And then at the bottom of the screen, let's go and find reset. Okay, now they give us three uh, ways of the reset. I want to select factory data reset. Okay, this is very important. You have an external memory card, uh, remove it from the phone. And everything is going to be deleted on the phone's internal memory, like pictures, videos, contacts, um, web history, <coughs> excuse me, downloaded applications and things like that. But if you agree with that, and also it is very, very important that you know your Google account and password associated with the phone because after the factory reset, uh, you have to confirm or verify Google in order to proceed and get to the uh, home screen or initial setup screen. If you fail to confirm Google, your phone will be um, blocked permanently. So uh, please, please make sure that the email address from Google and password matched and work properly. So you can go to another different uh, device, make sure and log in with those credentials, make sure that you have it right. All right, so once you are ready to reset the phone, just uh, touch reset and enter your password pattern or PIN or um, and now once you have that then touch delete all okay so here basically the phone will start to reboot and um, delete all the information stored in this uh, phone okay so um, this is how to do a factory reset so just give the phone the time to uh, delete and take you to take us to the initial setup i mean uh, initial setup screen and if the phone gets stuck on the logo samsung get freeze they're gonna show you next step how to do a uh, factory reset okay so uh, so your phone gets stuck on the on, on the logo or whatever let's go and press the power key uh, up to like 10 to 10 20 seconds until the phone uh, will or the screen will power off okay and then uh, usually uh, uh, usually when do this um, the phone will restart only or um, will power off completely so now with the phone power off let's go and press the volume up key and the power key at the same time from three to five seconds and the phone will, uh, the logo appears, release the power key, continue holding volume up. And when you see a recovery menu with blue letters, just release the volume up key, okay? Now using volume down, let's go highlight and uh, wipe data factory reset. Press power key to confirm. And volume down to highlight factory data, data reset and then press the power key to confirm. And the phone will start working at the bottom. And Reboot system now has been highlighted auto automatically. Press the power key to confirm the um, reset with the external keys. Okay, so now just give the phone another time to work and do the um, factory reset. And um, if this continues to happen with the phone freezing, uh, don't worry about it. Just uh, press, I mean, yeah, power down the phone, start over again with the same process we did using volume up and power key. You can do this, repeat this process up to 20 times. Uh, um, users in my channel has, uh, through the comments, they told me that sometimes they have to do it, up to, they have to repeat the process up to 20 times and then the phone uh, finally uh, uh, worked properly and took, took them to the home screen. So just uh, be patient and um, <clears throat> let me know in comments if you have any other questions and uh, let's uh, wait what happens here with the phone okay so now we are on initial setup screen so just uh, press the start button to continue um, select terms and conditions next 
Okay, now go ahead and insert your active SIM card from your carrier to detect data or you can use Wi-Fi. I'm going to skip this step anyway. Uh, you need internet because you need to verify Google in order to proceed and get to the home screen. So uh, you can go ahead and um, copy apps and data with the same previous um, uh, Google account that you use on your phone. Okay, so just I'm going to show here don't copy because I don't think I don't have anything to copy on this phone. Uh, select your date and time uh, and then leave every Google products on and then uh, accept terms and conditions from Google you can go ahead and block, lock your screen with a password pattern or pin or you can do this one once you get to the home screen on settings ok skip anyway <clears throat> Alright, you get recommended apps. You can use my site. I don't like this app, but uh, you want you can have it if you would like to. Uh, skip Samsung account, or you can go ahead and register your Samsung account. Um, you can do it later as well. Accept terms and conditions from track track phone, and then. Alright, you are all set up. We are on home screen with this Samsung Galaxy A42 smartphone let me know if you have any questions please subscribe to the channel hit the like button if you like the video and if you like to donate something for the channel there is a thanks button underneath of this video just hit the thanks and then donate whatever you would like to donate to the channel to improve their quality thanks so much